Imagine this, what if there were no elections, no government and no states? The world would become a wild, lawless frontier where survival would be the only goal. This concept is known as the state of nature, which is believed by many philosophers to be the starting point of human society. So humanity has experimented with many forms of governments like monarchies, oligarchies, autocracies until one champion rose above all, democracy. Democracy is a form of government where it's the people that decide who would govern them. This concept is known as the consent of the governed. So the beating heart of democracy is elections. Democracy is popularly believed to have started in ancient Athens some 3000 years ago to set the stage for direct democracy where the citizens directly participated through open voice votes on issues of governance. However, back then the right to vote was only limited to the rich and land-owning male members of the society and women, slaves and the poor were excluded from elections. Then in the middle ages, elections were cancelled in many parts of the world for many centuries as the world was ruled by monarchies and theocracies. But then in the 18th century, elections made a comeback with the French Revolution. The system of indirect democracy was installed in many countries such as the US, England and France. Indirect democracy means the elections of representatives that make decisions on behalf of the people. The 19th century also introduced paper ballots, providing a more private and standardized means of voting. Fast forward to the present, where digital age has ushered in a new era of voting. Electronic voting machines and online platforms have streamlined the process, enhancing accessibility and efficiency. But whether you cast your vote on a ballot paper, on your phones, or with the thousand-year-old traditions of eyes, nays, and beats, just remember, that the future of the society rests in your hands. The hands that cast votes, shape policies and define our collective destiny.